Hi, I'm Mel and welcome back or welcome to my channel. If you are new, please subscribe and I thank each and every one of you who has subscribed so far. If you subscribe today, I thank you too. And in today's video, I'm going to be sharing you, with you how to make a washi tape flower. Um, for me, I'm just using this as a bookmark, so it will be a washi tape flower bookmark. And it is dead easy, really, um, once you've got the hang of it. So I've just got a bit of card, you can use any card, this is like an old card that I'm just going to use. Um, a paper clip and I've just got my, one of my rose gold ones out of my pot. And then this is what it is, is washi tape petals. It's kind of like a normal reel but it's just petals that peels off but it's super cute. So I'm going to show you how I'm going to make, how I make my own washi tape, washi tape petal flower bookmark and this is my new journal that I just got recently which is quite boring and plain but it is navy blue which is my favourite colour or one of them anyway and yeah let me know down below uh, in the comments if you would like me to do more bullet journal ideas, styles etc um, but yeah I will get on with this DIY now um, so let's go Okay, so first up, oh, she also needs some scissors, by the way, I forgot to tell you that. Um, first up, you need to get um, your card, like so, and you want to get all your petals. This somehow takes me two rounds of petals, but you all you need to do is, for the first bit, is peel off a petal, you can just see my hand, and have this half on, half the... The petal that would be on the outside, yeah, stuck to the card and the other half that would be closer, not stuck to the card. Does that make sense? And then keep going with this until your whole flower is on there basically. I think, the, well, with this one, which I got from eBay, it takes me two rounds, but it's, how, it's up to you how big you want the flower. Okay, so as you can see, I've stuck them all around the edge. I have done two rounds or a round and a half. These ones come in it, so I've just stuck them down. I don't need them, but I thought I'd show you the tape a bit more. So the tape's like this. And you just peel as you peel away and you can just see my hand as you peel away you can see all the petals come off and then you just peel off a petal at a time or unstick them and then you just put them on the paper like that and now you just need to cut them all out so I've got my scissors and I'm just going to cut round to cut them out then when all your all your petals are uh, cut out just cut out a circle out of your card It doesn't have to be exact. And then you've got a circle. And then you need to make sure you can tape your, um, what's it called? Your uh, paper clip. You need to make sure you can tape your paper clip to the circle so i was going to just i probably still am going to just use the petals but i'm just going to tape it down just so i know where it's going and that's like the middle you can tape it as well as you want you can even use what's it called um you can even use like glue if you want to and then all you need to do is stick on the petals it doesn't really matter what but you can tell what which petals which petal is for where that makes any sense and you can just see you can bend them up to make the flower and then you can see like you can see you can bend them all up so as you go round you can make 
the petals stand out 3D more. Then you go in another layer and another layer till your flower's complete. Again, you're adding the petals wherever you want. And you can fold them up as you go or however you want. Just make sure that they stick down in place. And then this is the final layer. And there you have your flower bookmark. And then yeah, you can see it's like 3D, which is really cute. And just make sure that it's all stuck down and secure and it's good to go. And then the back's all secure too. Okay, so all you need to do then obviously is paper clip the page you were on, which I am trying to do one handed, like so. And then fold the book up. And there you have your little flower poking out the top. It's really cute actually, I really like it. Um, so yeah. And that's it for today's video. If you liked it, please give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below your favourite flower. And if you would make one of these. Have you ever heard of washi tape petals? This is pretty new to me. But I am loving it for my bullet journal. Uh, please also subscribe if you haven't already. And thank you for watching. Bye.